and welcome to my channel welcome to my video so we are doing a what i eat in a day i thought i would do something a little bit different i filmed the footage i really didn't do any talking i didn't really want to do a voiceover so i thought let me try something different and do it more of a like confessional <laughs> So this is quite a good breakfast if you ask me i mean it's not the most exciting breakfast i tend to have the same every single day but um why change something if it works i think the only improvement that i would make on my breakfast is it's probably not filling enough so i think i need to start adding some protein to it having like a smoothie for example or maybe i don't know having peanut butter on toast or something like I think I need to have a little bit more in the morning to make it a little bit more filling or maybe there's something I could sprinkle into my cereal that could make it a little bit more filling add a little bit more fiber like I could add flax seeds to it so yeah we'll see we'll see <laughs> I made myself a smoothie after breakfast so in this smoothie was kefir I, don't, I still don't know if that's how you pronounce that um but there's kefir there's blueberries there was banana but something new that I added was lion's mane so that's meant to be good for like focus memory concentration I find that I get brain fog um like I will start saying something and like mid-sentence forget what I'm saying or I'll go and do something and forget like the other day I got in the shower forgot that I'd left something cooking on the stove the water had nearly boiled dry by the time I remembered it's really bad so I was like you know what let's do something for our cognitive function and see what can help so I started taking lion's mane it doesn't taste the, be the best um, which is why I've put it in my smoothie well, it was a pretty good smoothie if you ask me I mean I was being good I had rice cakes as my snacks these rice cakes were quite nice actually so this was my crisp alternative so these are the salt and vinegar flavored rice cakes and yeah they were a great crisp alternative when I just got that craving for some salt and vinegar it's great I think they also do a sweet chili one and a chive I can't chive and what chive and onion I don't know <laughs> Yes, the stove needs cleaning. However, lunch was pretty boring. Um, yeah, don't have much to say about lunch, it's pretty boring. It was noodles, it was super noodles, or it was Aldi noodles or Tesco noodles, I can't remember which, but it was something, it was quick and easy. Um, from memory, this is actually a work day that I was filming a what I eat in a day. And when I'm working, everything's like quick, 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 because I'm usually between meetings so yes I had super noodles for lunch that day because it was quick and it was easy I wouldn't say it's the most nutritious meal or the most filling meal either but that's what I had
think I got the most nutrition from my dinner this day. So I had white rice. What did I have? It was turkey mince with various seasonings, but then I decided to add lots of veggies to it to get those into my diet. So I added red pepper, corn, broccoli, carrots, and spinach to get some extra iron into my diet. And it was really, really good. It was really, really nice. I definitely recommend it. And it was a really filling meal. So that brings me to the end of this confessional what I eat in a day. It's probably the easiest video I have filmed, um, to be honest. I've quite enjoyed making this. I hope you guys enjoyed it as well. If you did, then yeah, please give it a like, support the channel, drop me a comment in the comment box below. Let me know what you thought. Subscribe, stick around, join the fam. I'd love to have you here. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.